Welcome back! Today's tutorial is a hair tutorial. We're gonna do four styles, really, really easy to do. Some of them, they are more dramatic and more intense. Some of them are really romantic and perfect for any type of occasion. So, we're gonna start. The first thing that we will do in my hair is to give a little bit of volume. For that, I'm gonna take my strainers and I'm gonna use the GHD Calypso strainers and I'm gonna start creating some waves to create some volume to my hair. Obviously, I've used a heat protector first. Uh, if you have more curly hair or you hair has volume already, you can skip up this step and move on to the hairstyles. This will give just the extra volume my hair needs and then I'm gonna fix them with a little bit of hairspray and we are done for the first hair tutorial. This first hair tutorial is really easy to do. We're gonna just start twisting our hair from one ear to the other, like this. And then once I get into the other side, I'm gonna separate a small pore, uh, bunch of hair. And I'm gonna twist it around the ponytail and secure it with a bobby pin, and we are done. Easy, quick, and super cute. You like it? So we're gonna go right away to the second one, which is my favorite. We're gonna start with the loose hair, and we're gonna separate it into a bunch of hairs, and we're gonna start braiding each part. <laughs> we're gonna do the regular three-way braid, and we're gonna start braiding behind the ear. That's important, behind the ear. We're gonna do all the way down until the end, and we're gonna secure it with elastic band. Try to use a very small one. We're gonna do the same on the other side, and again, secure it. Now we're ready to create our hair band. We're gonna take one braid and take it to the other side, creating the band, and secure it with a couple of bobby pins. And then we're gonna do the same with the other one. And we're gonna make sure we cover the end of the first one. And this last one, we're gonna pull it inside the first one to cover the end, and we are done. If you don't have fringe, you can release a couple of um, bunch of hair in the sides, and you're done. Third one is a little bit more classic. We're gonna do a down bun. We're gonna take this donut tool. We're gonna create a side ponytail, pass the hair through the donut, and start rolling up the donut until you get the base of the ponytail. Secure the bun in place with bobby pins, and we are done. This is a more classic take of a bun. Very cute bun for a special occasion. They took us a minute to do. And we are done. So let's move for the last one. This is the more rocky one. We're gonna separate the fringe area and pin it off. If you don't have fringe, just separate that area. And then we're gonna brush our hair and create a high ponytail and secure it. Then if you need to, use some hair spray to create more um, smooth area. And then we're gonna work with the fringe. We're gonna come out with our fingers and then start back coming from the back and then smoothing from the front. Use the hairspray to start creating the hairstyle and use your finger to comb it. And then, then when you are um, happy with the fringe, how it looks, just brush your ponytail and you're done. A little more rocky style hairstyle. Which one is your favorite? You like more romantic? You like more youthful, classic one? Or you up for a rocky one? Just let me know in a comment. And thanks for subscribing. The really quick and easy hairstyle to do. So thanks so much for spending some time with me. And see you next one. Bye.